Hi everyone, my name is John Deegan and I'm a Partner Experience Specialist at Google. Today, I'll be taking you through our App Policy Center and showing you how to identify policy violations, find out what's causing them, and submit them for review after they've been fixed. If you would like a more general overview of the App Policy Center, click on the suggested video on the top right-hand side of the screen. The App Policy Center is a convenient destination for you to understand everything related to policies and take action as needed before it affects your account or ad server. Let's have a look at it together. First, sign into your AdMob account and then click on Policy Center. If there are no policy violations, you will see this page in your Policy Center, which is great news. If you have a policy violation, you'll be notified in the home dashboard of your AdMob account and via email as well. In case you have policy violation warnings, your notification will look like this in the AdMob home screen and you'll have 30 days to fix the violation before ad serving is limited or disabled. If you have a policy violation with ad serving or limited or disabled, you will see a slightly different alert in the AdMob home screen. You can either click on View Policy Center or choose Policy Center from the left-hand side of the menu to review the notification details. A list of policy violating apps are shown in the Policy Center. In this particular example, you see the first app has disabled ad serving, while the second app only has a warning. You can open a policy violation item to check the details such as issue date, type of violation, and how to fix it. In the case of a Google Play violation, you need to click Fix in Google Play to learn how to fix this violation. Moreover, you can check a policy violation guideline by clicking on the violation. Once you understand the violation and fix it, you can fill in the review form and click on Request Review. You can see the review progress in the Policy Center and you will get an email notification when a review request is received. Please bear with us while you see pending. This means your app is being reviewed. When a review request is completed, you will receive an email notification stating whether it was accepted or rejected. You can also check the results of a review in the Policy Center. If you see not approved, this means that a review has decided that the app is still in violation of our policies. In this case, you will need to re-review the policies and request another review once you have fixed the violation. Here are a few quick tips to make sure that the review process goes smoothly. Please don't forget to update your app before requesting review in order for the violation to be removed. The exception to this is if you believe your policy violation notification is an error. In that case, you can request a review without updating your app. For Google Play violations, please make sure to upload the new version of your app to Google Play. If your review is accepted, ad serving will be re-enabled on your app within 24 to 48 hours. The Policy Center shows violating apps that have generated ad requests. Once the violation has been fixed and a review is successful, the notifications may take some time to clear from your account. We hope this video helps you better understand how to identify, understand, and address violations within the App Policy Center. For more information about Adma program policies, you can refer to the AdMob Help Center and AdMob Program Policies page. Links to these pages can be found in the description of this video. Thank you for listening, and let us know in the comment section if you have any suggestions for the next policy video.